I can't quite believe I'm doing this interview in this way, but how has that match ended up as it has in the end? Um, mainly us presenting Tottenham with the, uh, with the goals. So frustrating. It's, uh, it, was, it was frustrating enough to, to allow them to equalise so late on. So 93 and a half odd minutes of the game, we put in really good work. Looked like we are going to see it through, but uh, to equalise, I think the equaliser was... I felt a little harsh, but then to uh, to concede to Leon is, is, is very, very naive from us. So um, you cannot you cannot do that. Do you let the players kind of sit on it in the dressing room and address it tomorrow, or did you have a word with them after? No, that? no, no. You, you you have to do it then. Then you know it's it's one. There's obviously a learning takes place, and it'd be disappointing. But you, you cannot you cannot lose a game like that. You know, the fun. You know, I spoke at half time about the fundamentals in our in our passing that we needed to be tidier and, and clean the game up a little bit more. Um, but but second half was really some of the fundamentals of defending. You know, we had a couple of duels where we needed to win a, a couple of headers and uh, and we didn't do that. And then we're on the back foot and they end up scoring. So, so yeah, disappointing. In terms of the positives, James Justin back out there tonight, was that always going to happen or was it something with Luke that made you want to change the game? Yeah, yeah, no, we wanted to give him some game time. Uh, Looks done fantastic for us. He had a big bump on his head, in fairness, so he had a bit of swelling on there, excuse me. Uh, but the plan was to get JJ onto the game at some point. Uh, so the nice 30 odd minutes, great reception from the crowd, and, and good just to get him back out there again. Do you think it's fair to judge Leicester at the moment, given how many players you've got away, injured for one reason or another? Do you think you can kind of look at Leicester and maybe even other teams in the league and make an assessment because of the way things are at the moment? No, no, you, you get measured by the team that's out there. I've always said we never make it as an excuse. You know, we were 2-1 up, 93-odd minutes against a top-level team and, uh, and we should win the game, but we didn't. So the assessment is, uh, is, is pretty clear for me. We, we can't be looking at players that aren't fit and available because a lot of them have been out for a period of time. You've got to at least draw that game, but you must, you should win it. And we didn't do that. So that's what we got to be judged on.